<laughs> so do strangers, I have this happen to me sometimes in like, like the music world, but do strangers come up to you and just divulge the weirdest things to you because of Curb Your Enthusiasm? Yes, so because Curb is this, um, you know, sort of a commentary on social graces mm -hmm. and the lack thereof. People come up to me and they like to pitch shows to me. So I, I did this movie with Ray Romano. We exchanged numbers, but we never, we had never called or texted each other. So um, at the rap party, Ray wasn't there, but this guy was like, I've got a great um, story for Curb. And I said, oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> and so I don't know how much I can say on daytime television, but so you he, can say it all, we'll edit it out. Okay, it. you'll be fit. <laughs> um, so he said, so my wife and I were having difficulty getting pregnant. So I had to go give a sperm sample. Yeah. So I went to the doctor and there was no good porn and I was having trouble <laughs> and there was, and, and I wasn't allowed to use lubricant. So I was, and this is a- You guys, I've literally been there. <laughs> This is like my story so far. Maybe we should do an episode. I love you right now. Maybe we should. So far, so good. So far. Okay. So he's, keep going. so he's telling me this story with all these details, and I. And he's a stranger. Stra never met him before my Talking life. about his sperm. Yes. And Go, and, and, keep going. Yeah, so I said, uh, uh, okay, I got it, thank you, and I will tell Larry. And he walked off, and I looked down at my phone, and for some reason, my phone had pocket-dialed Ray Romano, <sighs> who I had never talked to on the phone before, and I said, uh, uh, oh my gosh, and I hung up, and then I looked to see how long I had been connected to him, and it was like five minutes. So, oh. then I start panicking, and I'm like, do I, do I call Ray and tell him? Uh, uh. And then my friend was like, don't, don't call. Maybe he didn't know it was you. Just let it lie. And then the next morning, like first thing in the morning, Ray Romano calls and he's like, uh, did you call me in the middle of the night? And I said, uh, uh, I did. Because the guy with the sperm and he didn't have lube and it was, uh, <laughs> and, uh, and I said, and then I looked down. And then I, <laughs> oh my God. And I looked down and, and I was connected to you. And I said, oh my gosh. And he goes, yeah, I didn't hear any of that. Oh. oh. And he said, but, but, but say it again and slowly. This yeah, time. yeah. And he's like, oh my, anyway. So Cause now he's gonna use it. Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah. So that God. was my first. That's what hilarious. an epic right. butt dial. Yeah. Oh, no. oh my gosh. Oh, this is such a Friends episode with Monica Geller. I love it. Yeah. It's like, I'm breezy, so I was breezy. It's so good. <laughs> it's, I love I'm, that you chimed in. I've so been there. Literally. Yeah. <laughs> Best part of today. <laughs> <laughs> you really connected you with You guys, that. I yes. mean, it's a process. Yeah. Okay. I will not stop talking until you subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's right, and I can talk a lot. Seriously, not gonna stop. Yep, still here, not going anywhere. I see you. Don't walk away from this.